Well, testing drugs on children. Tonight, a local research company is trying a new flu vaccine on young people. Well, with health departments low or already out of vaccines, officials say clinical trials may be the way to go. Larry Seward is here to explain. Larry? Elizabeth, last year's H1N1 outbreak spiked demand for flu vaccines. This year, health officials say it should be no different. So when it comes to clinical trials on children, officials say it's a judgment call. Are you done? Are you done? It's stressful. Six years old, knowing your right arm's a bullseye for needles. What? Still twins Josiah and Joshua Meyer smile. Each will get up to $350. The reason? They're guinea pigs in clinical trials. Phase three testing of this new flu vaccine. The side effects are minimum, if any. And Dr. Carl Pettit is lead investigator for Radiant Research. Their job is to inject 70 local children ages six months to eight years old. It's a four-month blind study paid for by Sanofi Pasture, this country's leading flu vaccine supplier. This shot supposedly offers more protection, more immunity than anything on the market. In Johnson County, it's especially valuable. Currently, we are out of vaccine. Nancy Taws directs disease containment for the county's health department. They hope to get more vaccine soon. Until then, Taws strongly suggests parents find ways to vaccinate their children, but when it comes to clinical trials... If they feel comfortable, then, you know, I, I would think that that would be fine. But again, it's it's your personal choice, your comfort level, your physician's recommendations. Was that bad? <gasps> Yay! Yeah. For her sons, Gina Myers has no reservations. She's been here before, so... I trust Radiant Research, so I wouldn't be afraid to let them decide what was best. They wouldn't do anything that's too you know, scary for me as a mom. Her six-year-olds agree. Soda. As long as they get paid. Now, so far, Radiant Research has 23 children participating. They need 47 more. For more information about their testing, visit our website, NBCActionNews.com. Look under health. Larry Seward, NBC Action News.